guys, it's Cameron here, back with another video. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and turn those post notifications on so that you don't miss an upload. If you guys noticed my nails in that intro, I know, disgusting. I broke one of them and then I just started taking them off. So I'm trying to wait till closer to when I leave for school to get them done. So they're just gonna stay crusty. So I figured I'd point that out to you guys. Anyways, for today's video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about my favorite YouTubers, the YouTubers who've kind of inspired my channel and inspire maybe some of the videos I do on my channel, some of the ways that I talk to my viewers, the ways that I design my channel, kind of just everything overall. Some of them I'm actually just getting into, so I figured that I'd share those with you. I feel like we're in a day and age where people who take inspiration from others are looked at as copiers or unoriginal, but I personally think that it's very important to take inspiration from others, especially people that you look up to and people who have this platform that's purposely there to give you guys inspiration. I feel like it's so important to take that opportunity and use it in your everyday life. Of course, I definitely recommend always making things your own, adding your own spice to things, which I definitely do. A lot of my video ideas I do think of myself, but a lot of them I do get inspiration from others, but I always add my own personal like oomph oomph, yeah, oomph to it, um, because I feel like that's very important in having a successful YouTube channel. I also wanted to show you guys some of these YouTubers because I know a lot of people struggle on YouTubers to watch, and you know, you get sick of sometimes watching the same person all the time. Some people are looking for new people to watch, and I feel like this also can give you guys an idea of like what kind of videos I like to watch and see if you guys like the same type of videos. But I'm just going to stop talking, and I'm going to get right on into the video because I'm excited to share these channels with you guys and give you guys my personal opinions on them. So without further ado, let's get right on into the video. Okay guys, so I have to start the video with my favorite YouTuber. If you've been watching my channel, you guys know who that YouTuber is, and it's Desi Perkins. She is my all-time favorite YouTuber. She is a beauty guru, but also does some lifestyle, some fashion, some like home decor. She kind of does it all, and that's the reason why I'm just so inspired by her videos and her mentality and her like confidence and everything. She's just really kind of helped me have the confidence to actually make this channel and make videos. I feel like she's taught me a lot of lessons about confidence. She's also amazing at makeup. She's freaking beautiful and I love watching makeup videos. You guys will kind of figure that out. Okay, the next YouTuber that I love is Carly Bible. She's another beauty um, fashion YouTuber and she is beautiful again. I've been watching her since I was really, really young. She's a fellow Jersey girl, so I support her for that and she's just amazing. Oh my gosh, she's so good at makeup. She taught me so many tips and tricks and I just love love that and also she's another positive role model and inspires me a lot the next one is Lissetti or Lissette if you guys know who that is she does a lot of girl talk videos feminine advice videos hair care skin care fashion, makeup sometimes. She's always giving so much advice. I've learned a lot of lessons from her because she does do a lot of girl talk and a lot of videos of that sort and I feel like those videos are really important to have, especially for you girls who don't have older sisters out there. It's so important to like find that YouTuber that you love who does those kind of videos because there's so many things that you need to learn and sometimes you're not being kind of taught that and then I feel like she's one of those youtubers who like gives you such good information especially like on female hygiene and just taking care of yourself in general so the next one is Chloe Ting and I just started watching her videos she is a workout fitness page and she posts her meal preps and she posts workout plans and challenges and amazing workouts I just started doing it a few days ago one of my coworkers actually told me about it and I love her I first of all like I just love her in general she's such a positive person As as I've literally said, I've used that word a thousand times in this video, she's just really in shape and inspiring and I look at her and I'm like, oh my god, if I had a stomach as flat as hers, well, I would literally not know how to act. So I feel like I'm just very like motivated when I watch her videos and like I said, I've only been doing it for a few days, but I'm definitely going to continue doing her workouts because she's amazing. Okay, I'm really into like the smaller YouTubers, people with like 80k, 100k, 200k. I feel like sometimes their video quality is even better than some of the YouTubers who have like millions of subscribers. They're at the point where they're already making so much money and they're already up there that sometimes when they get up there, they start to lack all of the good content and they start to not be as consistent. That's why I lean towards a lot of smaller YouTubers besides like my select few who are very big. I've been watching a lot of smaller YouTubers lately. So one of them that I've watched that I've been watching since I literally had my first YouTube channel. Her name's Amanda Politano and she has like 200k and I, I just like her videos. I feel like her videos are very relatable because she reminds me a lot of myself. 
myself and how I act and I like watching people like that because it's like oh my god like I feel like we're friends but like we're not but it's just relatable and I like watching her videos it's just... okay another youtuber that I've been watching a lot lately is Danielle Marie Carolyn she's um does a lot of like just lifestyle videos vlogs fashion videos a lot of college videos and that's why I like watching her videos she gives a lot of advice and she's very inspiring very motivated she has like a very set routine schedule which I like a lot I like to have some youtubers that I watch who are like that because it motivates me to be like that and motivates me to kind of put my life on the right track and be more um, structured and just plan out my days better wake up early like get my day started and I feel like I like watching her videos because she's like makes me like okay like I need to be productive today so another youtuber that I like and I specifically like one type of his videos which he actually hasn't put one out in a while but it's Shane Dawson's conspiracy theories I don't really watch any of his other videos besides his conspiracy theory ones but I love conspiracy theories I'm really into like spooky like dark videos that kind of stuff if you're bored one day i would just binge all of his conspiracy theories because it's insane he hasn't posted a new one in a while he did like a movie on it last year like on his channel it wasn't like the best compared to his old ones i mean i guess there's no more theories he has but i wish he could find some and make a video another youtuber that i really like she just does kind of like everyday videos vlogs lifestyles some videos um, like on her relationship and stuff. If she's also pregnant right now is Nazneen Kavari. She's just so gorgeous and I love, love, love watching her videos. She has like such a life that I'm like, wow, I wish I had that life. But she's also about to have babies, so that's exciting. Another one. Who? Oh, she just popped up. I'm going through my subscriptions because it's helping me. Miranda Sings, Colleen Ballinger, whatever you guys want to call her. I've been watching her since day one. She's so funny. If you're just trying to watch a funny YouTube video to make you laugh or just get in a good mood, watch her videos. Even just her videos as Colleen, she just has such a bubbly personality, but if you really want to laugh, watch Miranda videos. It's funny that I'm 19 years old and like I'm just still into the same YouTuber that I've been watching since I was so young and she just makes funny videos. Another YouTuber that I've been watching lately is Maddie Sedlick. She does vlogs and lifestyle videos, a lot of vlogs, and I just like watching her videos. Again, she's another one that's like very productive and on top of stuff and she makes me want to be productive and it like motivates me. Another YouTuber that I like to watch is Tiara Walker. I just started watching her recently. Recently. Her videos are so good and she's another one who's just so pretty. I just like watching them. She does a lot of self-care videos, which I love watching. It gives me a lot of inspiration on things to do for self-care, but it also just makes me want to do more self-care. If you guys used to watch Dance Moms, a lot of them are YouTubers now. Chloe Lukasiak and Kalani Hilliker. It's funny that I watch them because I used to watch Dance Moms so much. But now I watch their YouTube videos and I feel like they just make really good videos. If you guys remember from the Vine days because that's where I originally found her from. But now I watch her YouTube videos. If you guys know Lauren Geraldo, I like her videos a lot as well. I love Daisy Marquez. She's another beauty guru who I just like. She's beautiful. I love how she does her makeup. I get a lot of makeup tips from her as well because she's so, so good, so talented at makeup. And I just like watching her videos a lot. I also like to watch Katie. So if you guys know Desi and Katie, they're best friends. Um, I started watching Katie after I started watching Desi because they're best friends and I just, yeah. But Katie has really good videos as well. Same thing, beauty videos. Some other videos here and there, but I mainly watch her beauty and fashion videos. She dresses so nice, so I like watching her fashion videos a lot. So lately I've been watching this girl Sadie Aldis' videos. She's in high school, but like, she literally has her life together so much. But I actually found her because I was looking up Plan With Me videos, and I happened to find her video. And I get a lot of video inspiration from her because she does a lot of organization and stuff. And that actually inspires me to be more organized, but it also inspires a lot of my videos and how I want to do that kind of stuff. I actually saw she did a video like this, but I didn't watch it, but I just saw she did it. So I'm like, oh my god, that's a good idea. So that's kind of who I got the inspiration to do this video from. But I didn't watch her, so I don't know who her favorite YouTubers were. I love watching Kylie Jenner's videos. I'm guilty. Like, she has such an amazing life. Like, I watch all her videos and she uploads them just because it's so entertaining. I wish I had her life. And, like, the videos with Stormy are so, so cute because Stormy's adorable. So I don't watch couple videos, but the one couple that I watch is Slice and Rice because they don't do, like, cringy couple videos. They do, like, funny videos. And I just love them. They got married recently. They also used to go to Towson, so... How's it represent, okay? Yeah, no. and they make me so happy. Like Another YouTuber that I love is Roxette Arisa. She's another beauty guru, and she just does makeup so beautifully. She does so many PR unboxings, which I love watching PR unboxings. She does hauls, 
vlogs not actually not vlogs so much but I just like love watching her videos and she's just so cute and bubbly and like I just like her videos are very entertaining and exciting and I like them a lot another youtuber that I really like watching is Haley Sunny she makes a lot of like girl talk videos advice videos like Q&A's she does like health videos sometimes like eat, eating well and like vegan and stuff she does like makeup videos she does mainly like lifestyle videos so it'll be like everyday makeup videos that kind of stuff similar videos that to what like I like to do so that's why I watch her videos a lot she's just very genuine and down to earth but like she also will say it how it is and I just like that about her somebody that I watch for a lot of like decor tips and stuff is Angie Bellamar she's like older but she just has like a beautiful home and she decorates her home so beautiful I don't really watch any of her other videos, mainly just her decor, because it gives me a lot of inspiration for that kind of stuff. I also really like Tati. She has a lot of good videos. It's all like beauty and makeup and stuff. I go to her whenever I'm looking for new products and I want to try things out because she does amazing product reviews. I think that's what's my favorite part about her channel. Oh my god, how could I forget? I freaking love Patrick Starr. I love watching his videos. He is so motivational. He talks just so highly of himself and of others and he's confident. His videos are entertaining and funny. When he does makeup videos and tutorials, he won't just sit there and be like, okay, I'm using this, this and that. Like, he'll actually talk to you and like actually be like funny and like make me laugh and like entertain me and make me want to like actually stare at the screen and watch rather than like do other things while he's like playing. You know? Another YouTuber I've been watching is Kenna Marie. Just for like I like a lot of the types of videos she does so I get a lot of ideas from her. She also helps me with a lot of editing tips because she has her older videos or like editing advice and like making thumbnails and like working on iMovie so I've learned a lot from her and her videos. So I like watching Shelby Church and... Sierra Furtado, like, they're, like, people I watch. Meredith thought, Meredith, Meredith thought, Meredith Foster, what was I just saying? Oh, my God. I watched them all since I was younger, and, like, I don't watch all of their videos now, but I definitely watch some of them. I watch a lot of Shelby's videos on, like, how to make money on YouTube and stuff. All right, guys, so I think that's it for all the YouTubers that I really like to watch and that I've been watching lately. I may be forgetting some, but I don't know. I kind of just went through my subscriptions list. If you guys have any suggestions for YouTubers you think that I'd like, or any YouTubers even who make different types of videos that you suggest for me to, like, start watching, just comment your favorite favorite YouTubers down below. Also let me know if you guys watch any of the YouTubers that I listed and tell me because I want to be like, okay, like we watch the same YouTubers. Okay, no. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, comment down below, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you all on my next video. Bye guys.